Codex. It may not seem like it, but they are an important part of rendering an LMD. The two main third-party codecs used by LMD dealers are FFD Show and UT Video, and they are the best in their category. One is Lossless Codec, and one is Lucy. Lossless means that it doesn't drop in quality, it doesn't degrade that, the frames you see on the screen, while on the other hand, Lucy means the exact opposite. It degrades the frames you see on the screen, and so the optical result is not looking as nice as when using a lossless codec. Then why use a Lucy codec, you ask? Well, it depends on what you want to render and how capable is your computer. FAT Show is a Lucy codec, and it is very easy on our computer. It doesn't require a lot of resources, and the videos it outputs don't take up a lot of space. Oh, render types are also smaller as well. UT Video requires a beefier computer, and the videos it outputs take a lot more space. We are talking about gigabytes here. Still, this doesn't mean UT Video has only disadvantages. You see, FFD Show has some quirks. While FFD renders stuff a lot more faster and outputs videos that are smaller in size, it is also less color accurate, and that means that it makes your videos le look less prettier. Like I said, it is a Lucy codec, and that means it has to cut down on something, and that something is video quality. Also, FFD Show is not only great for rendering at 60fps, and it doesn't help with great video quality in the first place. So you have to use YouTube Video or some alternative. YouTube Video is, as stated, a lossless codec, and that means it gives out the best color accuracy and picture quality. Although it makes files that are considerably bigger, it does a better job when it comes to rendering overall. YouTube Video supports frame rates and resolutions like 1080p 60fps, 1440p 30fps, and it can also go lower than that. Ask me how I know that. You get what you see. There is also AVI RAW that does the same thing as UT, but it makes files that are... How to put this? Like, big, like 20 times bigger. I advise you don't use AVI RAW as it will fill up your hard drive in no time. Unless, you know, you have to because of some feature that works with AVI RAW only. I did a render test with an animation of Lavarno walking for 40 seconds to check the video quality and color accuracy, and while AVI RAW updated a 4.12 GB file, UT only spit out 234 MB and FFD 29. But you have to keep in mind that file sizes might increase as the video render is very simple and the more colors you have in your video, the bigger the render result will be. By the way, I use those settings to render everything and those settings to render in UT. Please don't play with the frame device count as that differs from system to system, don't touch it basically. Now, to sum everything up, advantages and disadvantages. FFD Show makes smaller files, renders faster, and you don't need a great computer to run it, but it uploads less prettier videos and it is less color accurate. On the other hand, UT Video is a less less codec and this means you get what you see. There's no quality downgrade whatsoever, but it's more system intensive and it makes bigger files than FFD. So, which one should you choose? Well, it depends on what you want to do and how good is your computer. I personally use UT, as although my laptop is kind of old at this point, it is still a somewhat decent machine and I have a good amount of space left. But if you're having issues with managing space on your computer, or you have a computer that is not very powerful in the first place, and you can deal with the lesser image quality, go for FFD. In the description down below, I left a link to the files I render of that 40 second animation that you can download and see for yourself what FFD or UT looks like. But I recommend that you download both and see what works the best for you. In all reality, you should never upload AVA files to YouTube directly and you should put them to a video editor or at least to Handbrake as YouTube doesn't play well with raw MD files. But this is a topic for, well, not a video. Okay, okay, so end card times. Um, <laughs> wow, thank you for watching the whole video. That helps a lot. You may not know, but it actually helps a lot. Anyway, in this whole video, I had a bit of help. I credit that everyone that I, well, got the infra from or got models or sounds even in the description below. It's a new thing of mine, 
that that probably sh should be done by more and more people but hey and I'm still thinking about how to fill this section because it's just so empty it's just me talking and probably a few things will pop on our screen from moment to moment but yeah I'm thinking about featuring some artworks of your yeah my people my subs and stuff anyway it took quite the work to make this video and I really hope you enjoyed it so yeah that was all for now. Bye. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and all the other.